Hi everyone, it's Alamu here today, and today we're going to be reviewing slash opening unboxing haul. I don't know what the hell we call it. It's a haul, it's we're trying things on from drum roll. Mm, I know it's a sad drum roll, maybe I'll insert it in. Anyway, so we are going to be reviewing everything five poons. Yes, I know that's not how you say pounds, poons. Everything five poons. <laughs> anyway, for those of you guys who don't know, I can't speak. For those of you guys who don't know, I live in England currently. I'm American, moved here recently. Um, anyway, so everything five poons, obviously it's based in the United Kingdom. Uh, and I was really curious because I saw a lot of um, British YouTubers reviewing it. And I was like, wow, everything is five pounds? Five pounds comes out to like seven to eight USD. So it's actually not that bad, depending on hopefully the quality isn't bad. So that's why I wanted to try it out. And you know, every person has their own um, opinion. And I hope you guys are interested about mine. Anyway, so I actually streamed my shopping experience uh, on Twitch. And just know if you guys want to follow me on Twitch, and I do play mostly video games, but from time to time, you know, shopping experience with you guys um, on Twitch. Just know I don't shop often because I want to save money for other things like food. Um, <laughs> and just know purely everything that I got from my haul came from donations. And if you guys are interested for me to do other hauls from whatever you think, clothing, products, just let me know, comment below, and also know that if you want to also help, you can also donate. I'll put the links down below. Anyway, here we go. Anyway, so here's the LMU experience on Twitch. So today, we're gonna do something special. I wanted to try everything five pounds. I follow a lot of beauty fashion vloggers on YouTube. I've done like a couple things that have to do with like, I guess like reviewing like costumes and cosplays, but I wanted to do a little bit more of a chill side so I can talk to you guys. I kind of took a look at this website really briefly, but I kind of wanted to go shopping with you guys so I can look at it and everyone in the chat, you guys are gonna be part of the video too. And everything is apparently five pounds or five poons. I like to say poons, I don't know why. But everything is five poons. I don't know if the quality is good and you have to pay shipping per an item. So that's really interesting. So it's not really five poons, it's five poons something. So I'm assuming like eight or nine poons in total for uh, per uh, item. And on top of it, I'm, going to also you know try these things on when it actually comes to you know my place do you want to go for bestsellers i feel like bestsellers would help but they might not have my sizes we'll go through that and then they have like a whole range of what sizes you can choose from so now you guys are it's gonna be a little personal you never heard anybody say poons well now you have um i'm a size i don't i didn't know there was in between I'm a size 10, 12. I'm just trying to find some cute dresses. Uh, maybe a cute outfit. I like this. I just hate the choker part sometimes. That shit, sometimes I feel like I'm being choked. Where am I gonna wear that? I, I swear to God, if I went like that, my boobs will come out. Like, <laughs> what's velvety? Oh, velveteen is a velvety. Well, duh, it's velvety. They start from 3.95, not per an item. See, it's, oh, it's not per an item and start from 3.95. So it's based on weight. Uh, I like this one. This one's cute. What do you guys think? I don't know if I should get the pink one or the white one. Five are in it. Get both. No, 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 no. I don't want to get both. She, she. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll get the white one. This looks kind of cute. What do you guys think about this? That actually looks nice. I would not get it in this color because a lot of my clothes are black. So I would try to divert from this. But would this be too close to my skin tone? That's my question. I like the back though. How am I gonna get into this outfit? That's another thing. That looks kind of cute. That's like the same pattern that we saw. Do you guys think I look like look good in this or would I look too weird? I am going to pick a size 12. Hopefully it won't be too bad on me. I feel like I'm in between 10 and 12. I hate that I am in between sizes. Oh my god, look at this! This is so cute! I like this dress. How is this? An XL is a fucking 12? Okay, I think I can- I think I can squeeze into a 10. I like the like a boss thing. I didn't know they came in different colors. 
I guess I have no choice to get this one. Okay, I'll get Ash. I feel like I have a lot of gray, light grays. I'm like debating between this color and this color. You think navy? All right, David, we're gonna go navy. I think we have enough in our shopping bag, do we? I have six things. Mm -mm. Oh, that's actually not that bad. Um, 38.22 is around. Pounds to USC. That's about 53, 59. I would round it up to 55 for like conversion fees. But that's not bad. That's not bad. Welcome back, you guys. Magically, now we're back to the present. Anyway, it took me one week to get it, which isn't bad. Unfortunately, I was not available to pick up my package, so I did have to go to my local post office to go pick it up, and I was like, pretty far. Anyway, so let's get, let's get started, shall we? It comes in a, you know, pretty standard thing that says everything fivepoons.com. I'm very sad because you saw that skater dress with all the penguins. It, uh, they let me know that they canceled an item because it wasn't there. They sent me an email, which is good. So they canceled the bird print dress um, and they refunded me. So that's cool. Anyway, so I'm going to, <laughs> sorry, I haven't done one of these for a while. <laughs> I'm so used to just gaming and just do my thing. I'm gonna take it out, show you guys on me, and tell you guys how it feels. So, we have the first one, which I'm so glad they put in first. It's like a boss. And I got it in medium slash large, which is UK size 10 12 in the color ash. And mind you, anything that you see here is probably sold out. I mean, I can try to link it if the link exists, but usually their um, their stock changes constantly because it's five poons. If, if, if it's a really popular item, it'll just go out. Because uh, I was watching some other vloggers and there was a really cute dress she got and I went to go look for it or she linked it. It just wasn't there anymore. Look at it, like a mouse. So it's a pretty, I think it's a pretty standard uh, sweater or top. Pretty standard sweatshirt, not sweater, sweatshirt. I think it's gonna be, maybe it'll go past my booty a little bit, but I do like the material. It feels really soft. Um, I like soft material. If this is shitty material, I would cry. I would tell you guys. And then, by the way, they're not sponsoring me. But if you guys want to sponsor me, everything five poons, that'd be great. Anyway, so, <laughs> um, this is, makes it warmer, this kind of fabric. I don't know what it is. It's not, it's, would people call it felt? Cause this feels like felt, but whatever this is, I hope you guys know what it is. It makes it a lot warmer. So this is great for warm days, shit for when it becomes spring and summer. Because I mean, if you want to be in this, by all means, I just know I'll be sweating like a pig. All right, we're gonna try this on. I think this looks kinda, this looks actually really good. I think it looks good. I wish I could show you guys in the mirror. I wish you guys could see my sneaker. That's how I look like. I think it looks good. I like it. It's really comfy. Super comfy. Like it, like that. Mm -hmm. I know I'm crazy. Alright, on to the next one. This is a dress. This is the Vita Navy Medium Size 10 UK dress. It's like the one that looks kind of like uh, military sailor-ish, I would say. Okay, I can tell you the material is, it's okay. It's not really stretchy fabric. It could be worse material. I can tell you that it's kind of stretchy, but I wish it was softer and stretchier, I guess. Um, I don't know if it tells you what kind of material it's made out of. Cause usually these, usually clothes have um, they have a little tag, but 
It's five poons. So anyway, these are like the nautical looking things that I thought was cool. It's like a boat neck. This is actually pretty short for me. I can't imagine someone who's taller because I'm 5'3". I would probably have leggings under this. I can't imagine if I picked up anything, my, my under is already out of the booty. The booty's showing. The booty and the panties are showing. Um, I'm wearing high heels with this. I think it would go well with also sneakers. I am a strong believer of sneakers being good with anything. Um, probably also flats too. But this is super short. I would definitely wear leggings or some kind of stocking. Act like I'm doing. I'm, I'm not like accidentally like tipping over, but I am tipping. These are really high, high heels. I don't wear them often. I love sneakers and flats. I like being comfortable. Did I, did I back up far enough? Is that good? There you guys can see. And this is literally about to show my... Yep. But I do like these things. These are nautical stuff. Um, I kind of wish this was a lot more stretchier. And then it kind of ends here. Where my shoulder is, it kind of ends in a weird spot. I don't know if you guys, uh, look how disgusting my mirror is. <laughs> but it does definitely end at a certain weird spot. I'll show you guys up close. So, as I was saying, you see, my shoulder ends here. And this cuts here, which isn't the best thing. But I wish it would be here. That's my gripe. But, as you can see, this material is kind of stretchy, but not, like I said, I wish it was just a lot better material. But this is what we got from the Fat Poon shop. And that's not that bad. It could be worse. Could be worse. <laughs> and up next, this item. What is it? Oh, this is a really crazy color dress, I think. Um, this size, I got size 12. Um, black, multicolor. Okay. That's that's what they categorize this dress as. Ooh. It's. I think this isn't like. I don't even know if it's just fully long sleeve or just cuts off at my wrist, but we'll see when I put this on. Um, it calls it She Likes. <laughs> I love the material. It's cotton. The print is, you can't feel the print at all. It's just part of the fabric. It's been dyed in. I like how stretchy this material is. It, it's, it looks small, but I'm sure it stretches. And I like how this kind of fans out, but it covers your legs. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me see if I can show you guys up close. Do you guys see it? It's kind of like a petal or a rose petal. So first off, it's comfortable, kind of, but it's a little too tight. So maybe I should have gotten large. I don't even know what, what size did I get this in? What size did I get this in? I think the multi-print I got size 12, which is my size. But this is way too tight. Maybe I should have gotten a large. Did not know that, but usually mediums fit me well. This one actually is sucking the sole, but it is very comfortable. I don't know if it suits me. I think it suited me when I didn't have my pants on. But if I don't have my pants on, you would literally see my underwear. That is not good. That is not good. So here it is on the side. I need to walk further. Here's on the side. That looks like this. We're looking close. Ignore the disgusting part of him here. But, I mean, it doesn't look bad. It just feels super tight. Usually, I, I wouldn't want it this tight. I want a little loose like that. It does shape to my body pretty good. I just wish um, it wasn't this tight. <laughs> Damn, I should have gotten the, the size a little bit bigger. Just one size up. I can see my rolls, my rolls, my rolls, my rolls. I can see my rolls, my rolls, my rolls. <laughs> I can see my rolls, my rolls, my rolls. <laughs> All right. We have this white dress that we really like. Um, just by looking at the material, it looks kind of cheap. But I need to touch it. It's really weird, I need to touch all the fabrics, like even when I'm shopping at, from H&M, Primark, um, Macy's, 
If I shop somewhere expensive, it doesn't matter where. Usually the more expensive places, they use good, like really nice feeling material. Let me tell you. But you can also find really nice material when you go shopping for cheap clothes. It just depends if they decide to pick that kind of nice feeling material. So anyway. This is the white dress that we ordered. Uh, let me see the size. Did they write the size? So it's medium, UK 10-12. By the way, um, my American size for dresses is eight. And UK makes me 10, so did I gain weight when I come here? <laughs> Doesn't matter. Everybody's beautiful no matter what shape and size they are. Or color, whatever the hell. Um, it, this material is very light. It, it kind of reminds me of the stuff that you wear to like somewhere sunny, hot, and this is very light, breathable material. But you know, I wish it was a lot softer. I don't know if you guys can see like what kind of material this is. I'm pretty sure some of you guys know what I'm talking about. Just letting you know, it's not hard, but it's not super soft and stretchy. It's like, if it was on the scale of soft and then of uh, like just feels rough, it goes down to like here. It's not quite in the middle, but it's closer to like this area. Um, I do like it, although it kind of looks different in real life. <laughs> we shall see. I hope it will wow me. I feel like this is something I don't mind wearing for fun, although it kind of looks like a wedding dress or something of that sort. But uh, hopefully I'll find an occasion to wear it. <laughs> it does make me look super, um, oh my god, did you guys see that? The light just changed? It makes me look super tanned. But I think it's the lighting that my camera is just readjusting it. But still, it's hilarious. I'm like, ah. All right, before we talk about anything and show you anything, I found there is a hidden zipper. Usually when there's a hidden zipper, yeah, you're supposed to kind of be able to see it. I couldn't even tell. I actually had to like, it actually was more hidden up here. And I had to slowly push it down for it to actually be where it was supposed to be. It was that hidden. Good job. I will say I hate things like this because it's like, naturally, how can I pull it up? Uh, I will definitely need to like hold this and pull it up awkwardly, but I'm not gonna show you guys on cam because it was really hard. It's really hard to do this. Trust me, it is hard. I'll be back. All right, so this dress does, so it's actually, I like the fit, um, the zipper. It kind of hangs out here. I don't know if you guys see it, just, just kind of just dangles. Kind of like, <laughs> hi here. But um, I like the feel, the fit. I don't know when I'm gonna wear this. It needs to be ironed out a little bit because there are crinkles. But it is pretty. It fits nice. I don't like the zipper thing. I'm gonna show you guys. See if I can show you guys what I mean. It's like the little. It's like just dangling. Let me zoom in. Let's go. Just you know, I'm gonna just chill here. Yeah, it's like a nipple kind of thing. <laughs> but all in all, it's a nice dress. It does feel kind of cheap in a weird way. Like it does. I think I just need to iron out. I don't like, you know, how it crinkles easily. Um, but it is nice. It is sort of see-through because I can see kind of my bra. Like if you come closer, you can see kind of if it, but the color is wrong because it's actually like dark, dark. I'm gonna say dork. Dark red, dark violet red, burgundy wine red. So it, you can't really see the color, but you know, you can definitely see that, you know, what I'm kind of wearing under. Um, underwear wise, yeah, you can kind of, you can actually see the underwear color through it. I don't know if you guys can see, but uh, come closer. I can't see my underwear. Other than that, it's not a bad dress. I like it. It's five poons. Can't really complain. I feel like really pretty and girly in this. It's not bad for five poons. Would I wear outside? I have no idea. It's just not exactly my style. Up next, and, and up next we have, is the last one, which kind of remind me of like pocahontas -y. And I've, I don't have anything like this, so that's why I picked it. Um, 
I know I was debating between black and brown. We ended up with brown because I have a lot of clothes in black. We need to like make sure my wardrobe isn't just one shade. Cause sometimes I feel like people don't pay attention to what you wear and they just assume that you're wearing the same damn black shirt or the black dress. So I don't want that. I want different colors. Um, and also when you, whenever you dye your hair or you change your hair color, basically some colors don't look as good with your hair, if that makes sense. I don't really like wearing um, black clothes if my hair was black but I enjoy wearing a lot of darker colors now that my hair is super light because it just brings out my face and my hair color. I don't know, it just brings out my skin tone, my hair, all that fun stuff. I'm pretty sure you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I'm hoping this feels really nice um, because just uh, looking at the material online, it just looked like it would feel like, like fake animal skin, I guess. Not that I want to wear real animal skin, I just like the look. Does that make sense? context anyway um, this is a large UK 12 um, it's really weird because I don't want to not fit in it so never feel ashamed if you think a large means I'm you know bigger that doesn't mean that it just means that you have different proportions because I have big boobs and a big booty and that shit does not fit in certain sizes I can wear extra small small medium to large but it depends on your how you you know want it want it to fit if you want a tighter fit then go ahead and do that extra small sometimes it can definitely make me flat chested because it's like literally squeezing everything but um i tend to go for medium and large because i want to be comfortable i don't want to be in tight clothes all the time anyway and also i'm very scared of not fitting and i'd rather be comfortable and for it to actually really fit me well than to be squeezed and being like i'm passing for a medium anyway Let's look at this. The material could be a lot better. Um, it's, I would say that this part feels nice, like I wanted it to feel nice. Inside, I don't mind this going next to my skin. They could have chose a better fabric for it to be like super nice, but judging by the price point, they obviously couldn't get, or they just didn't want to, you know, up the price point, and this probably wouldn't be five coons. What sold me was the back. The back had a really cool design. Um, one thing I didn't think about is getting into this. I hope I don't have to undo all this or I'd be really, really, really sad. <laughs> all right, one way to find out is to try it on. Let's hope this fits me. So first off, I wanna say it feels nice, but it creases a lot. I don't know if you guys can see. Um, is it comfortable to wear? It is comfortable, but it flares out weird to me. Kind of goes like, it's kind of like, and then with the crinkles, it's, it has to be iron, I think, if it can be iron. And if it can't be iron, you can always put like a sheet or something in between and iron this. However, I just don't like the way it flows and it just sits really weird on me. I wanted, I want it to be a little bit more like this, but I think the material needs to be more expensive for what they're trying to like create. It just doesn't sit on me well, or it just doesn't look good. Um, I have no idea what the return policy is, and I'm going to look into it and tell you guys at the end of the video, but for now, we're looking at this. I like the back. The back is pretty cool, um, but uh, I also found out there's a hidden zipper over here too. It, it wasn't hidden like last time I actually saw the zipper, so I knew what was going on, but I try to like see if I can fit it without doing this, because doing these are the most awkward thing in the world, so I stuck myself. I was like, please, and I actually like a shimmy down on, which is good. A shimmy down on. Um, so that's a good thing. I I, ha I was wearing my bra. I was able to take it off. So you don't have to wear a bra if you wanted to wear like, I guess the, the strapless ones. You can if you wanted to, or the silicone that just holds like this. You can, but right now I'm not wearing any. It's pretty good. And I'm gonna show you guys how it looks on the mirror as well. From my point of view, Oops. All right, this is what I'm seeing. Not bad, but I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about, the crinkles. See the crinkles and it's just the way it moves is like, just like the, I feel like, I've definitely seen uh, whatever they're trying to mimic, just better material would like sit on the body nicely, like nice fabric that would just drape and kind of like curve with your body. But this just kind of is like, uh, 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 just so stiff. 
and then sideways it's not bad like I said for five poons can't really see much about it and then let's see if you guys can get like a I don't know if I can can I sorry for that adjust it so maybe you guys can focus on the mirror yeah there you go that's that's how I see it huh that's the back of my head <sighs> okay that was exhausting I didn't know how exhausting this kind of video would be but it is exhausting because I have to run back and forth and all that fun stuff um so yeah clearly you can't see anything you can't see any nippy action happening which is really cool like I said I just wish this was a different material because just the way it flows at the bottom of the skirt <sighs> anyway um I'd love to know your comments about what you guys thought about each um you know article of clothing that came in do you think it looked like how the model looked like or you know just the picture and how did it look on me be honest um, I think some things didn't fit me the way I thought it would fit me and of course not everything is gonna fit because it, it might look good on the picture and you might envision something but when you wear it you're just like this is totally not me but this kind of it, it kind of is kind of my personality but at the same time I'm just like I'm weirded out because I really don't like to wear too many dresses. I'm not a dress person. Although, you know, a lot of people go like, oh, girls look great in dresses. So do boys. No. <laughs> anyway, um, what do you think is my favorite article of clothing out of all the stuff that came in? Um, and what is your favorite? Like, what do you think you liked out of the things that I got? I wish I got the skater um, penguin one because it was super, super cute. Um, it's unfortunate that they couldn't see that it was sold out and you know it tricked me and I felt kind of sad that I didn't get it um, but uh, definitely I think my most favorite one is probably <laughs> like a boss because it's it's the best it's like a really good material um, I feel like I got a steal for this shirt for five poons five poons um, and the Second, I guess my favorite is the the, the nautical kind of looking um, dress. Even though it is super short, the material could be a lot nicer, but it is, again, five poons. So I'm just taking a look about returns because I definitely want to return three of the things, or four, actually, three, three, because I want the, want the nautical looking dress and I'm gonna keep, obviously, this one. I'm definitely gonna return this. I really don't want to keep the white dress and also the multicolor. It just didn't look good on me. So, um, it's gonna be 14 days for the full refund or exchange. From the date of order, there is a maximum of 30 days from the date and the parcel was saved. Okay, so that's cool. Uh, I have enough time to send them back, so I should be getting 15 poons back, 15? That's not bad. <laughs> <laughs> I basically, if I don't like something, I will return it because there's no point in holding on to it and like hoarding shit ton of things. Um, but another thing is, if you're cleaning out your wardrobe and you don't want anything, you should really go donate it. Basically, if it's not bad and it's not like underwear and stuff that you can't, you know, it's better to donate than to just toss away um, clothes that are just as good as new if you, you know, someone picked it up secondhand. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, sometimes I will stream on twitch.tv slash alamu of doing some shopping. So it's one of those things that you have to catch uh, if you check on Twitter and stuff. Don't forget, most of my videos aren't sponsored. If they are, they obviously say so. Some of these hauls and product reviews, I'm doing it on my own. And if you guys would like to help me, feel free to donate down below. If not, that's fine too. And also don't forget to comment which was your favorite outfit, what you guys also didn't like, um, what should I review next? It could be clothing companies, cosplays, products. I would prefer clothes, but that's cool. I'm very open to things. And just keep in mind that this is coming out of donations and also out of my own pocket. And these videos are not easy to make. These videos are not easy to make. Oh, my kitty cat. My kitty cat. My kitty cat is here. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time and feel free. I'll see you guys next time. I can't read to read. I can't. I can't read to read. I can't wait to read your comments. Bye. Bye. Say bye, Oliver. Bye. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, let's tell.
the tail, the tail of my face. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to smack that like button as hard as you can. Just don't break your mouse, okay? <laughs> and don't forget to slap that subscribe button so you'll be notified when I upload any new videos. And I also stream live on Twitch. And if you want to talk to me, hang out with me, and watch me play live, all you have to do is follow me on twitch.tv slash See you guys next time.